everybody, and welcome back to episode 6 of Jurassic Craft! Yes, it is finally time. Finals are over for school. And it is now time to do videos in summertime and all that fun stuff, you know. Now, I've been doing a lot of work on the visitor center and that stuff. So uh, let me kind of show you what I got. Oh, I have the wrong thing on and don't need that. Sweet. So if we come over here, we have a road uh, leading from the visitor center over towards where the Brachiosaur is. Now, I'll get to show you guys this more in person once we uh, get over to the visitor center. And uh, before we go to the visitor center, have to check in with uh, the boss about it. As you can tell, I was obviously rolling my eyes there. But uh, yeah, we'll uh, go see about Snow being in his office. Uh, everything out here is still pretty much the same. So that's good. About midday, that's good too. Uh, office. Well, that's weird. Doesn't appear Snow's in his office right now. Could go inside, but... Mm, nah, we won't worry about going inside right now. Uh, yo, monster, you know where Snow is? Oh, yeah, what do you need, Afro? Uh, I need to know where Snow is. Oh, I thought I saw him walk over to the visitor center with his two guard buddies. Oh, okay, good to know. Later. All right, bye. Okay, well, now that we know he's already over at the visitor center, that makes things so much easier. Hello, Cax. Ooh, a bit of lag. That's okay. What's up, Cax? Oh, hey. Uh, moving on. Uh, oh, yeah, I heard something cool. If I strike a pig with lightning from the sword... I might be able to get a servant. At least that's what the legends told. But, let's see. Skipping it up. Oh, gotta walk across the crosswalk because I actually made one of those. Oh, hey, Snow. There you are. What's up? Looks like you finally got it done. Damn right I did. Now we just have to work on getting actual dinosaurs. Uh, yeah. Well, what are you waiting for? Go get that dino DNA going. I'm going, I'm going. Ah, uh, he's weird. Whoop. Ooh, some lag. Alright, let's see. Oh yeah, here are the materials for the road that I was using. Um, any more dino DNA? We do have some dino DNA. Sweet. Uh, let's put some tar fossils up in there. Let's see what we got in here. Lots of sand. I forgot I was making a bunch of concrete powder. Alright, there we go. Well, uh... I did make some plants, actually, in the uh, cultivators, because... I did that wrong. Here we go. Uh, we have some saplings that I'm hoping to go put in the uh, Brachiosaur pen, because, you know, trees. And then also, uh, well, itchy, uh, seeds. Don't know what, um, what they are, what they look like, but, uh, I guess we'll find out. And this goes in there. We also got our first Stegosaurus and Ankylosaurus DNAs. Alright, let's go take a look over at the Brachiosaur pen and see how that's doing over there. Whoop. And then... Um, let me think. What are we going to do today? Probably enough things. Probably work on the, you know, the enclosure. That's what it's called. Because it's not a cage. It's an enclosure. Uh, and then once I get over to that nether fortress, we can uh, start hunting down endermen and getting enderpearls for fuel. Alright, so over here we have... Uh, I need to get rid of the melons in the middle of the road, but... We have a key card reader that uh, I made a key card for. And then we have the inside of the enclosure if the uh, chunks would kindly load. We're gonna have a bunch of trees and stuff in here. Uh, chunk load. I know how to fix this options. Video settings, we're gonna turn that down. Let the chunks load back in. Here we go. And then just go back in. Turn my chunks back up. Here we go. Alright. 
we have a nice uh fence fence wall eh, kind of lining the area so that the brachiosaurus can't get out had to clear a lot of jungle for this a lot more than i wanted to but and a lot of concrete lots and lots of concrete mm. but we have a nice little one block lake over here so that uh oh my gosh so that hopefully if the brachiosaurs do go inside of it they don't like get stuck the brachiosaurs they'll they'll grow up quickly have to get some feeders in here too so that uh they can have food and some toys um all the good stuff that your dinosaurs will need but um it's about to the sun's about to start setting so better uh whoa okay calm down all right good the chunks loaded oh look we have a parrot over here I love 1.12. I love parrots. They are the best. Oh, yeah. I'll have to show you guys. I made an update to the visitor center because uh, I wanted to move uh, our mushroom from downstairs up to the top because mushroom is like another dinosaur, quote unquote. They're, it's something unique. And that's what this place is all about, having things that are unique. Oh, yeah. Uh, if the chunks would load, we need names for, we need a name for our green parrot and our macaw here. I also got us some more, uh, actually very pretty, uh, pottery. Okay, so that's not gonna load for a minute, but we have Bonnie the Mooshroom. And I just kinda had to sort this out. I have to sort this out. Here we go. Alright, so we need to have a name for our macaw. And our green birdie. And then we also have Bonnie, because Bonnie. Very beautiful. And then we're just gonna kinda run down here and, uh, sleep. Okay, so we gotta go take care of this. Um. We in here? Alright, then there we are down here. Anyone else? No? Okay then. Um. Well, I'll just patch that up tomorrow. Sleep. There we go. Alright. Now that I am now awake, uh, gotta get some dirt from outside real quick. Hua. Let's see. Um. I'll just go grab something over here. I have a very powerful shovel now because lots of gravel and uh, just digging in general happened while I was gone. So, we're just gonna hop, skip, and a jump over the fence. I'm just gonna nonchalantly bonk. We're gonna not worry about that anymore. Sweet. Moving on. Um, let's see if uh, Snow has anything else for us that we need to do today. Yo, what's up, man? Oh, hey, Afro, I need to talk to you. Uh, what do you need, boss? First of all, don't call me boss. Got it, boss. And second of all, have you heard from Willis? Willis? Who's Willis? Uh, well, I'm pretty sure you passed by his office, at least. Uh, I think it's a two-story... Uh, sto two-story office that was back at the base camp. Willis is our second archaeologist besides you. He was working over by the big lake looking for a good cave system. But I haven't heard from him in a couple of days. I don't know if he has gotten lost in the caves or something happened to him. Can you go up to the camp and take a look around for him? Yeah, sure. Thanks, Afro. I'm counting on your report. Okie dokie, man. Let's go. Big Lake, he says. Well, it had to be close to the base camp. So, if we look around the base camp, maybe it's towards the fossils and tar pit I have found. Because to find those, I kind of went around that way. Let's see, um, chunks, load. Do your job and load, thank you. All right, uh, we got some forest over here. I haven't seen a lake yet. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, for a second those trees did not load. Um, that, come on chunks, why are you being such a pain today? Thank you. Let's see, uh, zoom. This looks like a lake. Up on the mini-map, mini it looks like a lake. 
Maybe this is the lake we're looking for. It's so, like it's it's not too deep of a lake. Let's see. Um, maybe there's something over there. Um, he said on the other side of the big lake. So, let's see. Go find Willis's camp by the big lake. Yeah. So right. Oh wait, that's unusually. Looks like a tent. I mean, I guess he was right. It is by the lake. Oh, it looks like we found it. Oh, he was right. There is a cave here. Um, Willis, you in there? Hmm. Looks like nobody's home. Oh, yeah, it's milk in here. That's a bread. Sweet. Bread. Let's see. Willis's log. All right, uh, let's grab that real quick. I'm sure he won't mind me taking this stuff. He's, he doesn't look like he's in there. Willis, you down here? Let's see, um, whoa, this is a long tunnel. Looks like there could have been a cave in here. Maybe he's behind here. Willis, you in here? Okay, well, this just looks like an unexplored part of the cave, so we're just gonna not be the ones to deal with that at the moment. He doesn't look like he's down here. He would have, like, he would have placed torches all the way through if he did go down there. Um, the zombies, creepy. Well, if he's not down there, uh, maybe his log can tell us something. Day one. Found a nice looking cave, and I'm going to document what I find. Day two. I've begun digging into the hill in front of my tent. Hopefully I'll find something soon. Day five. I walked onto the hill this morning with some milk, and it turned out that the military have base have a base set up right beyond the flat of the hill. Hopefully they didn't don't interfere interfere before I can report this to Wait a minute. If that's true, oh boy, um, that place looks pretty secure, um, well, uh, before I end up like Willis, I should go and, uh, maybe report back to Snow. Let's go do that real quick. Uh, since I'm too lazy to walk back, we're gonna go blunk. Probably should have said of, uh, Waypoint to Willis's camp, but that's fine. We're not going to worry about that right now. Yo, uh, Snow! You found Willis's camp, but where is Willis? Good, yeah. Hey, yo, man. Uh, what do you mean the military have a base near Willis's camp? Well, yeah, Willis uh, might have been captured. Good point, good point. Uh, well, do you feel like going to see if Willis is there? Yeah, sure. All right, get prepared to, to, and find Willis. Okay, so I gotta find Willis. Um... They're most likely going to be, like, you know, the military there, so, uh, let's just grab out some of the nonchalant guns I have. Next episode, I'll hatch those dinosaur eggs, and we'll start working on tech guns so that I can get more of these. We have my revolver, we have my bolt action, and we got my Thompson. I think this should be enough. Um, I should probably get some better armor, but... We're not going to worry about that, because we're going to go beat up some military guys and see if Willis is there, because if he is there, we got to save him. Like, he's Willis. I wonder what Willis will say. He is the other archaeologist. I wonder if he'll go back to camp or what he'll do. Though, I did see iron blocks on the camp, so I'm sitting here kind of like, hmm, once those guys are out of the way... I will be taking those iron blocks, because iron bars are not cheap. They are not cheap at all. So let's just run over here, and uh, let's hope Willis is here. I hope he's here. I hope he's okay. Um, don't know the guy too much, but I'm sure he's cool. Okay, I think, yeah, it's right over here. Should be right over here, at least. Yep, there's the tent. Um... There it is. Let's see if I can scope out the area. Um, 
Let's see. Uh, oh, there is an army soldier in there. Oh, well, looks like something happened out here. Um. Oh boy, that. Ooh, that doesn't look like fun. Let's see. Um. Um. Might as well get ready. Get shot! Okay, so that was easier than I expected, but, um... Not sure how easy this guy in here is gonna be. Oh, ouch! Ouch, 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 ouch! Get out of here! Alright, ouchie, um... Hey, it's Willis! We found him! Alright, um... Yo, Willis, what's up? Uh, Afro? Where have I heard that name before? Um, well, I was hired by uh snow oh afro snow mentioned you bef you to me before i set up camp well the only thing i can say is thank you for saving me i got you i got you fam well um meet you back at the main base uh yeah see you there you kind of missed out on a lot um might as well go back and uh talk to snow and uh all that cool stuff. So, uh, let's run back there. I'm sure he'll catch up later. Oh, wait, I said I was gonna take those iron blocks, and those iron blocks will be mine. Bump, bump, ba -da -ba, bump, 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 bump. Yes, my singing is horrible. Deal with it. We're just gonna, we're just gonna take the iron blocks for now, and we'll come back for the rest of the stuff later, because iron blocks are good. All right, moving on. Now, let's go back to snow. Zoom, uh, visitor center. Alright. Well, I guess I didn't even need my revolver, really. Bolt action had it covered pretty well. Alright, uh, Snow, what's up? Nice work, you saved Willis. I did indeed. Oh, boy. Well, that's nice. I got some lead and stuff. Um... You're kind of stupid. I already mentioned that to you. But you know what? We're not going to worry about that. Um. Well, uh. What I do need to do is with this stuff. We should make the feeders. Uh, we need a bunch of these. So we need a bunch of buckets and stone. Bunch of buttons. So let, we need to make like. Mm, I want to say like. Eight or nine of these things, so we need a lot. Yeah, it says enclosures. I was right, it is enclosures. So we need, uh, we'll make like 12 of them because I'm going to need more later, anyways. Um, 12. Oh, yeah, I should probably also put something else in the uh, culture bats, too. Definitely need to uh, put some more plant fossils up in there so that I can get, you know, some more plants. You know, the gist. Um, and more sand in here because sand is all the more important. Oh yeah, I also found some more scarab gems. These ones we're going to make into aquatic scarab gems so that we can tame the bigger creatures, hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, so we're gonna go over here and... Oh, we have a bunch of coal in here. Good. And with this newly found iron that we have, um... We make 12 buckets. Let's see. There we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. And then I need to go get stones, so... Ooh, I did not mean to press those buttons. Well, let's teleport to home base. Ooh, it's turning nighttime. Uh, I'll just run in and run out. Grab 12. Uh, we need a lot of stone. Oh yeah, I also smelted up all the ores and uh, found more diamonds while I was looking for more... You know, all the fossils and stuff. Um, we need to grab stone, cobblestone. We need like 12 
Right. Um, forty-eight cobblestone. I am big brain. Maths. And uh, oh nope, we need another twelve times four. Yeah, and then we need another. There we go. Okay, we need sixty in total because we need twelve buttons. And then yeah, all right, we should be good. That should be everything. Uh, to the visitor center. Zoom. All right. Ooh, chunks load, please. Okay. Uh, let me make sure these doors over here are closed. Uh, good eat. Nope, not doing with the guys outside. I'm gonna eat some more of Willis's bread, and we just don't tell Willis that I stole his bread. And we're gonna come down here and, uh, sleepy sleep. We did it, guys. We saved Willis. Um... Wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. But I guess uh, if the military is watching this, it uh, looks like they're going to have to step up their game. And yeah, you know, they're just going to have to step up their game for it. Um, Oh yeah, hello birdies. Uh, I still need to figure out what to name you two. Let me see. Uh, What was I doing? I completely forgot. Oh yes. Um, smelting stone and getting the buttons and stuff. I'm stupid. I need to remember these things. Um, stone. Glass. Um, should also need to look into... Uh, I need to look into solar panels. Solar panels. I need to look into these because these will give me the energy I need for uh, tech guns. Which, these don't look too... Oh, never mind. Uh, so that one's impossible to make and we're not going to talk about it. Uh... So not gonna be making that one either. This one, this one. Wait a minute. Yeah, this one seems something I can make. Mm, glowstone. I hate glowstone. I'll probably be making a bunch of these ones. Solar panel four. Cause I don't need a lot of power. I just need a good amount of power. I also need to figure out. Yeah, I need to make soldier pants and stuff because they may be a bit better than my banded armor. Let's see. Uh, this stone is taking hours. Um. Oh, let's see what kind of plants we have. Ooh, more saplings. These saplings are gonna be very good for me. Uh. Oh yeah, we should go and try to make one of those pig uh guys. Let's see. Oh, we have the fangs on the top of our screen. We kind of look like, uh, let's see, he was in, uh, one of these up here, I think. Yeah, the guy laying on the ground there, we kind of look like him. Let's see, um, whoop. We walk upstairs, he should be in one of these pictures up here. Yeah, we look like this guy! Don't know, like I said, I can't read this, um, but I was told that we do have some very interesting patterns here, um, but let's go strike a pig and see if we can get a, what is it called? A uh, servant, maybe. Because in the uh, hieroglyph, stone tablet looking things, I don't know, I'm just going with it. Look, there's a pig. Pig, you will be my test subject. Ready, steady, go. Ready, steady, go. Tame the zombie pigmen, my lord. I will fight for you till the death. You gonna follow me around and stuff? You are! Well, um... Guys, we have to name- we have to name my new follower, I guess. I wonder what happens if I take off the helmet and stuff. That's interesting. And, uh, oh, well, uh, he kind of looks like a Jerry. I don't know. It, it'll have to be up to you guys. I am, uh, that was easy. <laughs> I need to get one of those buttons so that every time I do something like this, it's like, that was easy. And all the cool stuff. You know what? I need to start getting a bunch of veggies. Uh, you gonna keep following my guy? Sweet. This guy's just gonna chill with me. All right, let's get the 12 buttons out of the way. Uh, 10. Oh, no, I did bad. 10, 11, 12. Mm, buttons. Got 12 glass, 12 buttons, 12 stone. Oh, yeah, I also have milk. 
which means I can start doing stuff. Uh, mirrors. I could start working on the solar panels now, too, which would be great. Great, 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 great. Um, let's go up here, and we'll put a feeder down by the water, too. Uh, what was I gonna go get? Let me think. Um, what was I gonna go get? Uh, whatchamacallit, whatchamacallit. I am drawing a blank now. Uh, um, num. I wonder how much armor does this helmet give me? I don't know. It's not very durable, though, and you're kind of like, mmm. This guy is great. I could make an army of these guys. Um, veggies. That's what I was going to go get. Stop drawing a blank. We're going to go get a bunch of veggies from my house, and, uh, be ready to fill up the feeders, because we're going to have to monitor the feeders and stuff. And make a very big farm. I think over here, if people do ask what this area is, over here we're going to call it like the research area. Because this is where we have the majority of our scientists and stuff. Oh boy. Just a little bit of lag. It's fine. Just a little bit of lag. There we go. Please load in terrain. Hello, friendly zombie pigmen. This ain't good. Uh, oh, there it goes. Move, my friend. Wait, what? I can make you sit. Cool. This guy's just like a pet. I need to find a good name for him. I have a name tag that I can name him with. But we need to find a perfect name for him. Um, I'll probably use a bunch of potatoes and carrots from my sifters. I wonder if I could put seeds in there. Oh, I have a ton of apples, though. Apples will be perfect for it, too. I don't know how much food it'll give, but, uh, hopefully it'll give enough. I should definitely go mine up, like, the beetroot and stuff, because I need to just make a humongous beetroot farm. That's probably what you guys will see in the next episode over here, uh, maybe past the chicken farm over here. Well, no, because over there is when I, where I want to put, like, the saber tooth and stuff. You know what, maybe we could take people through the area here. Like, show them what, where this all started and, like, where everybody has started and all that stuff. Like, I sleep in the visitor center, but we don't tell Snow that I sleep in the visitor center. And, uh, I can't wait to start working on tech guns. We are going to be able to, uh, defend ourselves and all the people of the, uh, park from dinosaurs. All right, buddy, let's go. We're gonna get moving on our way. I wonder if, uh, I'll probably have to get Cax and Monster to move away from their office and help me down in the lab with some DNAs and stuff. And, uh, Monster's been acting a bit suspicious around the place. Like, while I was building this road and stuff, he was just kind of looking around. I'm like, mmm. I'm, I'm sure Snow hasn't noticed, because he's, like, his friend. Come here, zombie pigman. You're gonna chill right here. Actually, I'm not sure how his, uh, Snow would be like, yo, why is there a bat there? Again, he's pretty chill, but, um, we need to find a name. So your guys' goals in the comments are to name the macaw, the green bird, and our zombie pigman buddy here. Is that cool? I'm sure that's cool with you guys. I believe in you guys. I need names, because I'm not very good at it. Hey, pal, you're going to chill right there. All right. Uh, More sand. Fabulous. More potatoes. Fabulous. Just going to stock up on potatoes in here, because obviously I need to do that. Um, Let's hope the stone's almost done. Uh, 16 more to go. Not bad. I can make some of them now, though, so... uh. Let's go feeders. I can make eight of them already. Sweet! Alright, now that we have the feeders, um... Oh yeah, we're still doing the plant fossils in here. Oh boy, looking fresh! We got a bunch of saplings, that's good, that's really good. I'm excited, I also want to see what the ferns look like. I should make a greenhouse, like, off to the side here. 
because uh, that could have like all the plants and stuff in it. Now, maybe not for trees, but like for trees, maybe we'll have like a nice little orchard, quote unquote orchard for the trees out here. But uh, can't wait to actually get like cars and stuff and motorbikes so that we can like go down the roads and stuff that I've created uh, am creating. And uh, oh, good. Um, yeah, thank you for loading chunks. You need to do that more often so that I don't die. Um, did I grab? I did not grab the apples. Ugh. Uh, I need my key card. Let's see. Um, not sure if they have to be above ground, but I'm not going to take my chance and just put them above ground. I'm going to put one there. I'm going to put one here. Um,. We're going to put one relatively right over here. I'm going to put one towards the middle here. Uh, please load chunk. Oh, come on. Here we go. There we go. We're going to put you there. Um, let's put one right over here. Maybe one down over here. And uh, maybe one up here. People will be able to see the long neck boys once they grow up a bit more, but as they're still small, we need to put one like in the center there. But besides that, I think we're going to end it off right here. Um, I look pretty cool in this hat. I want to thank you guys, thank you so much for staying with the series and supporting it and coming with me on this beautiful, beautiful adventure. And I, if you do enjoy the series and want more, go ahead and like and subscribe and comment down below like the, uh, the names for our macaw, our green parrot, and our good old zombie pigman buddy old friend or pal. And, uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye!